Okay. Dear Tommy. When we were little, I didn't quite understand why you behaved differently, why you got stared at in public or why you got special treatment from mum and dad. Our lives always look so different from my friends' relationships with their younger siblings. Growing up together has never been the easiest as learning to be okay with you always being right, getting away with certain things and what seemed to be making a big deal out of anything is hard for a kid to understand who isn't allowed to do the same. <laughs> Can I just start off with saying thank you? Thank you for always giving me a big hug when I need it most. Thank you for always waiting for me at the door as I come home. Thank you for always making me and the people around you smile. And thank you for being my big brother. You are my inspiration, my rock, and as cheesy as this sounds, I don't think I would have been able to make it through 18 years without you. Are you laughing as well? <laughs> I felt it has always been my job as your big sister to protect you, and this is not always so easy as we grow through life. I was born with death. I have a fucking Can you hear me, Tom? Yes, I can hear you. But I know through the strength you have shown since that moment you were born that you are capable of things beyond so many of us in this world. I like to play with my brother Charlie. He's my little brother. I would like to say thank you for subconsciously making me the person I am today. For teaching me to be grateful for everything I am able to do. Not taking life too seriously, finding pleasure in life's small gifts that we are always stronger than we think and we are and that everyone has their own way of doing things. I love you with all my heart and I know that God blessed us with you and for that I am eternally grateful. You have taught me so much over the years. There we go. Our Superman is that? Such as if you, get, if you want to get out of an awkward conversation with just give them a short laugh and drive off with your watch. But seriously, you have taught me to be grateful for everything I have around me and to always cherish my friends and family. You have also taught me to always smile even through the worst of times and try your best to make it, everyone around you happy. Not everyone has a brother that cares as much as you do. And although this is not easy for, always easy for you to express, when you do, there is nothing in the world like it. I have six pigs. I'm... I like all my peers so much. I don't think that you will ever quite understand me and we will never be able to fully share our worlds with each other. I have awesome. But I want you to know that you will always be my best friend and best of all my baby brother. And with this trophy, I am, I am clever. That's right, Tom. So you learn a bit differently, but you're very clever, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. What are your favourite things to do? Mm, I try to be a teacher. I am so proud to be able to say I'm your big sister. Thank you for everything you have given me. I know that you worry about what your future holds and to be honest, most of the time so do I. But how lucky we are to have each other. It will not be easier to leave you as I grow up and begin my own story. But I want you to know that I will never really leave you and you are and always will be safe. Your disability has never stopped you from being the person you want to be. And I really wish people could see past it. But you don't, you don't care what other people think of you. You just smile it off and that's what I find inspiring. I am so proud of how far you have come from learning how to turn pages of a newspaper to now being the iPad expert of our household. I feel so privileged to have had the opportunity to watch you grow into a kind, handsome and charismatic 24 year old man you are today. I look forward to one day you cheering me on as I graduate and for being my, my, my future children's favourite Uncle Irfan. I love you with all my heart and I hope our relationship will never change. <laughs>